Hello and welcome to ISTV English News. This is Panorama giving you the news. Let's see the headlines. World Environment Day observed widely in Manipur. Appeals for planting trees galore. Let's see the news in detail. As being observed throughout the world, the World Environment Day was observed widely in Manipur too. The day was observed at the office complex of DC Imphal East at Porompat under the aegis of Subdivisional Officer. DC Imphal East M. Joy, who was the chief guest at the function, appealed to the people of the district and the state to take equal share of responsibility to protect and preserve the environment by planting trees at every vacant land of one's own. <laughs> ไอ้ก็ยิ่งเดี๋ยวว่ามณีปูร์ที่อวานุสิตไอ้ก็ซ่าเกี่ยวกับสิ่งไก่ดีนะอมังไอ้เดี๋ยวเรื่องบาดุ
The cross-examination will continue tomorrow. Sarmila had staged a hunger strike protest at Jantar Mantar in New Delhi on October 7, 2006, demanding removal of APSPA from Manipur. She was subsequently arrested by Delhi police and a case was filed against her on the IPC 309 attempt to commit suicide. Today is the second time Sarmila was produced before the Patiala House Court. The first instance was on May 24, 2014. Now, let's see some national and international news. After growing outreach, the Prime Minister's office has showed a report on the Meggy issue. PMO officials on Friday met the Union Health Secretary BP Sarma to discuss the matter. Nationally, India decided to take Maggi noodles off the Serbs across the country. The product has been under scrutiny for high lead in monosodium glutamate MSG content. However, National has maintained that Maggi is safe and there is some confusion around the product. Delhi, Gujarat, Tamil Nadu, Jammu and Kashmir and Uttarakhand have so far banned the sale of the two-minute noodles after concerns were raised over presence of MSG and lead beyond permissible levels in the product. The World Environment Day is being observed today to raise global awareness on protection of nature. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has launched a campaign to encourage citizens to plant trees. He himself planted a sapling at his official residence, Seven Race Coach Road, on Friday. The Environment Ministry will celebrate the occasion by planting saplings across the country. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister J.J. Lalita could file nomination papers today to contest a by-election from Chennai's R.K. Nagar Shet to be held on June 27. Ms. Jalalita, who was sworn in as Chief Minister two weeks ago, has to seek election to the State Assembly within six months of taking office. She was disqualified as a lawmaker in September last year when the Bangalore court convicted her in a corruption case. Sent to jail for three weeks, Ms. Jalalita had to step down as Chief Minister. The Karnataka High Court has quashed that conviction and acquitted her last month, clearing the way for her return as Chief Minister. She took oath along with 28 ministers on Saturday, May 23, in a swift hour ceremony. Days before she was sworn in, her party, the AIA DMK's lawmaker from Arkenagar, P. Vetriville, resigned to facilitate her election. Kashmiri separatist leader Syed Ali Saha Gilani on Friday wrote Indian in the passport application form, but after coming out from the office said he is not an Indian by birth. The separatist leader applied for a passport as he wants to travel to Saudi Arabia to visit his ailing daughter. But the Bharatiya Janata Party BJP raised objections over issuing an Indian passport to him. The BJP, which is part of the coalition government in Jammu and Kashmir with People's Democratic Party, said that a passport should be issued to him only after he apologizes for the anti-Indian remarks that he has made in the last 25 years. However, PDP said that the passport should be issued to him as it is a humanitarian issue. Well, that's all we have for now, but before we wind up, let's see the headlines once again. World Environment Day observed widely in Manipur. Appeals for planting trees galore. Thank you for watching the news and for more updates, please stay tuned.